Greetings everyone, with update 30.5 Sisters of Parvos releasing on all platforms, we have Railjack additions, changes and fixes. This video is specifically for those and will cover other information in their own individual videos as we've done so already. Starting it off, Railjack Command Rank 10 is now available and it introduces Elite Crewmates. They are stronger crew members who become available for recruitment from Ticker in Fortuna. These elite crewmates have two more competency points and they have a random trait based on which of their competencies have the most points. As an example, if their gunnery skills have the most competency points, this crew member could have 50% more damage with Zetki weapons. If their piloting skills have more competency points, this crew member could have increased effectiveness of Levan engines by 25%, so on and so forth. Also with this update, Corpus Spy and Survival Missions have been added into the Corpus Proxima regions and DE has said the following. With these additional game modes come completely new reward tables, including the new Ambassador Weapon, Ash Components, Railjack Mods, Parazon Mods, and much more. The drop tables have been updated on the Warframe Drop Tables website if you want to have all that information, but they continue. You'll notice that some Corpus Railjack mission nodes have been shuffled, and one additional Corpus node has been added per region to accommodate for this. So in Venus Proxima, the new survival node is Luckless Expanse. And the change is to Orvin Hark. It is now a spy node. Previously, it was an exterminate. In Neptune Proxima, the new node is a spy node of Brom Cluster. And then in Canoe, Ice Drifts is now a survival node. Previously, it was volatile. Lastly, Pluto Proxima, the new survival node is Fenton's Field. And Peregrine Axis is now a spy node. Previously, it was an Orphix mission. Lastly, Railjack crew members now have a more relaxed behavior when not in mission. As for those Railjack fixes, DE fixed crew members getting stuck in turrets after attempting to give them another order while they were still getting into the gun. A case where crew pilots would just stop if all targets were too far away. They fixed being unable to use the tactical menu while in the crew ship pilot seats. A script error when using on-call crew members. Infinite loads from the dry dock on the second Railjack mission after a host migration and a success successful first mission. They fixed an issue where the objective transmissions would repeat the one from the first mission when doing back-to-back -back Railjack missions. They fixed a soft lock when entering a Railjack mission with the Nightwave screen opened from the star chart. Cargo train entry objective markers not updating the position after ejecting each car in the Corpus Railjack missions. Kuvalich weapons overlapping over the UI in the crew management screens. They fixed crew members barks missing lip syncs. The press button to open the tactical menu prompt appearing on accounts with no ranks in tactical intrinsics, the railjack hull meter in the HUD not updating while you are in the forge screen, they fix the capital ship waypoint in railjack defense missions persisting in space after completion, the rising tide quest not being marked as completed after purchasing the railjack in the in-game market without re-logging, they fixed a camera detaching if a client tries to switch to the operator as they are leaving a railjack mission point of interest, no mod pop-ups occurring when players pick up a railjack mod in a mission, they fixed host migrations while streaming into a mission causing an infinite loading tunnel, seeing the dry dock in a yellow box from the front of the railjack window when entering the loading tunnel to a mission, an issue where clients could sometimes be unable to fire the forward artillery weapons, they fixed a script error that could occur when extracting from a railjack survival mission, a bunch of non-squad members appearing in the railjack in the relay dry docks for a bit, railjack weapons not firing at times, on-call crew members appearing like Mr. Potato head with mixed body and head parts, and lastly, DE fixed spectres not despawning when returning to the dojo after completing a Railjack mission. Those were the Railjack additions, changes, and fixes with update 30.5 Sisters of Parvos that is live on all platforms. Thanks for watching, and yeah, see you guys next time.